So in today's video, I've got a fun one that I want to show off. This is another solution that I've gone over a couple times, but we're just cranking it up just to the next level. In today's video, I'm showing you the ultimate DEX PC desk setup. So what we've got going on here is a widescreen monitor with a sit stand desk, full keyboard, full mouse, external speakers, even a place on the desk to charge your phone and your watch using the Samsung Tri Charger. The desk is from Fezbio. I think I'm saying that name right. If I'm not, apologies. It'll be in the description below. This was a sit stand desk off of Amazon. Quality has been really great in my opinion. And it's still a budget option without being super high priced like some of the other sit stand desks. On to the widescreen monitor. I'm using a widescreen curved monitor from AOC. This will allow DEX to fully support up to a 1440 resolution essentially. Um, it, it doesn't cut off or do anything in weird resolutions. DEX can support these nice resolutions, so that's nice. And with that, you can have DEX running on the top monitor while your tablet is still running Android. So you can actually have two apps running simultaneously. Uh, be aware with that setup how this all works with DEX and Android. It isn't really running DEX on both screens. So let's say you go to launch YouTube on DEX and then you go and use the touch functionality on the actual tablet and launch YouTube. YouTube will have to restart on that screen because you had it on DEX. But besides that, you can have like messages on the tablet and then on the widescreen up top have YouTube, whatever your scenario is, it works really good. What is powering all this connection together is a USB-C hub from Aki. Uh, make sure on any of your USB-C hubs that it's getting power, either power pass through through the monitor or another USB-C plug-in to the hub to power the hub in this situation. You need power for HDMI for it to pass enough of the signal through for from the tablet to the monitor. So that's why you need some power to it. Beyond the hub, we have a Logitech G915 TKL keyboard. We have a Microsoft plastic mouse. This is Microsoft's recycled mouse. It's just a nice little portable mouse. You could have an MX Master 3 or any other type of mouse if you prefer that instead, because all of this is using Bluetooth. Most of these devices should have no issues connecting over Bluetooth. Another item on the desk that you may see is the speakers at the back. The speakers are MX Sound from Logitech. These are uh, just some nice portable, smaller form factor desks. And of course the speakers on the S8 Ultra are great. So you don't necessarily need any speakers, but I wanted to have like a full desk set up with this. So I wanted to show utilizing desktop speakers, but you could use some Sony earbuds as well. Maybe the Link Buds, um, several options. I'll put in the description for that as well if you wanted to do that or even have some headphones as well for your chat communications or web conferences. So this is just really showing the flexibility again of what DEX offers. It, it's a really good desktop alternative. You get everything you would possibly need in a desktop solution. What I can really see a solution like this being used for is if you have your main PC down in your office and then you use your S8 Ultra and a external display to launch DeX. Maybe you have a little office off to the side or a desk set up to the side on your first floor off from the kitchen or something. Maybe you just plug this up to do some uh, simple work, you know, word editing or remote connection back to your work, or you could even do video editing on this. Uh, th this tablet and Samsung DeX really bring out what is capable with a tablet without restricting the resolution of some other tablets that 
can't really have external resolutions without just mirroring the display of the iPad. So this is positive in my mind because you can technically have two apps running, or even more than that technically, because with Dex you can snap and resize windows so you could have like two or three on the Dex screen, your widescreen, your, your monitor, and then on your tablet screen have another app running or two apps running again on the tablet screen. So you get a lot more flexibility in what you can be offered as a desktop alternative than what you can on iPad OS. I really challenge you if you're thinking about picking up an Android tablet, especially the, eight, the S8 line of tablets, to really find if there's something that you think is limiting to why you would have to go to iPad OS. I, I really challenge you to find something that is a s essential for you to have an iPad over this Android tablet. Nothing to Apple's iPads, they're great too, but Android tablets get a lot of hate when they're just as capable as the iPads. So I hope you like this desktop setup. It just goes to show you what Dex is really capable of when you push it to the limit. I will see you in the next video.